we will see how to fix this globe icon at the uh, Wi-Fi symbol or if you see this error while connecting to Wi-Fi connecting to Wi-Fi network so it's going to be six step process so don't skip any step it should be in the sequence only step one enable Wi-Fi radio so press Windows key and R key run will open type REGDIT click OK so follow my screen open um, we have to open class entry here okay so so right click and open string uh, create new string value rename it to radio enable and put value as one so close this window again so in the step two we have to enable wireless services open run again now type services.msc click OK now from the list um, find out this service network connection connected devices make sure it is automatic delete start then network connections it should be also running an automatic delete start so click OK save both of the services um, now make sure uh, the status you can see my screen now minimize this window in the steps 3 we have to refresh network options so open start menu type control panel open control panel now carefully follow my screen now go to advanced options here click restore advanced uh, settings now choose this entry apply now let's reset this also let's close this okay that's pretty much of it here uh, close this window mm. now in the step 4 we have to release faulty Wi-Fi DNS now open start menu type CMD right click on command prompt and run it as an administrator so now type this command carefully net sh win soccer set the next command is net sh win soak um, reset catalog so make sure all of these commands are in sequence so you don't uh, change its sequence net uh, the next is nest net sh ind ip reset reset log dot txt now just type cls now the next command is ip config slash release then type cls again type ip config space slash um, renew just wait for a while again type cls and the last one is net um, sorry ip config space slash um, flush dns that's it just type exit to exit the command prompt so now in the step 5 we have to uh, tune up our wireless drivers so open services.msc make sure uh, that wi-fi services is started so right click on it and start it go to its properties in the service type select automatic delete start select ok to save the settings mm. uh, now again scroll down and uh, find for radio management service and make sure it is running ok so minimize services now type windows and x key together open device manager now from the list open network adapters right click on wireless or um, adapter click browse Just follow my screen now choose any driver click on X to install the driver once that is done just close it you can just right click and update driver also close this window uh, and in the step 6 we have to set uh, proper DNS records now open start menu open control panel 
Now in the search bar, bar type uh, view uh, view network sorry view network connections view network from the list click on uh, view network connections now um, right click on Wi-Fi go to its properties now follow my screen so in this properties window in the alternate DL record um, type this uh, IP address I'll click OK I'll click OK and save this close this configuration now click on search networks click on your Wi-Fi um, entry and right click on it and forget it so again click on that entry and click connect so provide password and click next it should be connected but there's one more thing we have to do to keep it connected to internet so that's what I do always so open command prompt and um, type this command to ping google.com or any website which with a minus or hyphen t parameter just leave this open only since your internet is up now can consider downloading this eco-friendly search engine which beautifies your search experience and plants more trees on the planet it's free